Hello to all you guys out there in YouTube land. This is Jewel Ranger. Um, I'm doing something that I've been meaning to do for a very, very, very long time, which is kind of go through some of my favourite YouTube users, uh, some of the clips from their videos and stuff, and a kind of brief rundown of why I like them, um, and why I find them intriguing. Um, I wasn't going to do some sort of ma major massive look and like go through and and I, then I thought to myself, I might as well just do this on a kind of weekly, bi-weekly basis. So this is uh, three YouTube users that I have found recently that are not massively subscribed um, and I really like. So I'm going to keep doing this and hopefully um, give them some props and give them some love, YouTube love. Yeah, woo! So my first one that uh, I found has been a guy called uh, Lone Rook. Uh, Lone Rook 860 or Lone Rook 860. The fundamentalist that I'm going to address is this nonsense that atheists have no morals. Now, this is one of the more common arguments that I see on YouTube, and I'm absolutely sick of seeing it everywhere. It's this idea that, without an objective standard of morality from God, anything is permissible. You know, those godless atheists can't be trusted, all that rubbish, you know. And in America, you see this predominantly, you see this mistrust of atheists. I mean, it's very hard, I think, for an atheist to get into public office, to admit they have no faith. This guy, he's, he's really cool, he's really kind of chilled out, down to earth, and he kind of gets his point across in a very clear way. I kind of like people, unlike me, because I'm a bit of a rambler. I like rambling. Ramble, 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 real hard. Um, and he's done a really cool video called Atheists Have No Morals. It's a part one of a series. I'll pop the links up. Have a check of it. It's really cool. Subscribe to him. He's got a really good analogy in there that, uh, that really kind of makes the point. Really my word of the day, isn't it? Really, really. Uh, the next one, and hopefully I'm going to get his name right, is uh, Zarathustra. So Zarathustra, I'll put a with a name in the bottom so people can see what it, how it's actually. But he's a great YouTube user. He kind of reminds me of like um, a cuddly uncle in a really good way, not in a but like the way he kind of relates to you is kind of like well maybe that grandfather in the world was original advert, you know. Ooh. He is a little sweet, but not in a creepy way, in a kind of really cool and, I don't know, I, I, maybe I'm seeing what I want to see, but I find him kind of warm in a British kind of sense, even though he's not British. I've been entertaining myself answering uh, questions for atheists. It's something of a, a fruitless adventure, but it uh, has entertained me a little bit. But now I have a question for theists. Does God exist? Yeah, I think he's really cool. So check him out, and his videos all across are just brilliant. He does some really cool stuff. Um, I think his latest one is One Question for Theists, which I would check out if I was you. And then, obviously, last but not least, is the one guy that I just think is just cool, and he's done a great selection of videos, and I cannot, cannot recommend him strongly enough, which is Starfed Rogue. Starfed Rogue is cool. And his last collection is an Intelligent Atheist Reply. And it's a nine-parter. Now, if you haven't checked this out, check it out. I mean, I can't recommend this guy highly enough. He's like the freaking YouTube version of The Wire. Like, that's how good he is, in my opinion. I mean, he, the guy is just... The guy gets to the point. He's funny. He's informative. I mean, what else do you want on YouTube? I mean, the, I, I could... I could I, I can't recommend him highly enough. He's like, if I was a girl. I just found me a brand new box of matches. Yeah. Hi guys, Starfed Rogue here, and this is episode 9 of the epic saga called An Intelligent Atheist Replies. You see, Jazzy Hap thinks that if you can take one general prediction from an area of science and show or pretend to show that it's false, then you've broken that science. Well, this isn't the case. Wasn't that golden? 
Yeah. Starfed Rogue is an absolute great YouTuber and I highly recommend him to everyone. Subscribe. Subscribe to all three. Uh, give him a check out. Uh, thank you very much for watching these. This is Jewel saying peace out and have a safe journey wherever you're heading.